I'm on probation, I can't smoke too much Rolling through the streets, love my sober up 7 a.m. man, they know what's up We be on the rise, they just waking up Yeah, no, I don't supply, I just smoke it up Got the wrong guys, you don't know about us hey, This shit be too smooth for me to take it off Once you gon' break a fall Nah, I'd rather hit the stage with y'all Once I finish school, I take you on a tour yeah, started trying less, started getting more And this one's for the night, spent on the floor, on the floor What's up guys, Rive Sneakers back with another video and today we're going to be doing another unboxing video. Um, so yeah, let's just get straight into it now. There's one or two uh, sneakers that this could be. I will also be including um, two uh, other packages, not sneakers, uh, clothes, uh, clothing. Um, and I will be having a uh, huge clothing haul. Not like huge, huge, but one of the bigger ones that I've had, um, and won't be like one of the normal ones I have where I like unbox it on camera and stuff and show you. It's more going to be like several things. Some of them I don't unbox on camera. Uh, this one I am unboxing on camera. It's just not going to be on that video. I'm just going to show you guys what I picked up. Uh, we will be doing a steel deal or not. So basically, you guys will comment down below if I got this for a steal, which basically means. Uh, I was very hyped up and I got it for retail or I got it for under retail or I just got it for a really good steal. Uh, if I got it for a deal, that means that I just got it for a price that anybody would pay. Um, nothing so special about it. And if I got it for a gnaw, that means I got it way overpriced. There's something wrong with it. It was just a complete gnaw. So don't forget to comment that down below while you're down there. Don't forget to leave a like, smash that thumbs up button if you like this video and subscribe if you want to see more like this or unboxings, restorations, well obviously unboxings, customizations, etc. as you guys saw in the intro. So uh, I don't even really have my X-Acto knife anymore. That broke. It's not because of bad quality, it's just because I was just stabbing stuff, just being stupid. Um, <laughs> plus, I don't even know, okay? It just broke, okay? But if you want to buy it, uh, check out Andrus Direct. I uh, leave them in the link in the description of every single video. So yeah, if you want painting, clean, painting materials, dyes, cleaning materials, stuff for restorations, customization, cleans, uh, Zacto knife, they have different like shapes and sizes too, paint brushes, all that good stuff. Don't forget to check them out. You can find them in the link in the description of the video at Angels Direct, or you can find them in the bottom right hand corner of my channel art. So yeah, let's get straight into it. I'm just gonna cut this. Now, I thought this would be a specific sneaker, but since it's not double boxed and the last one I picked up of this wasn't double boxed, I think it's something else instead of what I thought was gonna, I was going to get today. Maybe I'll still get the other one that I thought it was. It's just going to come and like the UPS or something, not the UPS, but like uh, UPS or something like that, or FedEx, not uh, UPS, just normal mail. So I'm just cutting this open. Now let's just. Oh, yeah. It is what I. It was the second thing I thought it was. Ah! As you guys can see here, we got this Vans box. Um, now that I just thought about it, the last one was double boxed because it was in way better condition than this one. This one's like really beat up. Um, but it's whatever. Uh, this is normal Vans. It just had a cool design on it. It's not one of your normal colorways. Um, so yeah, we got this Vans box. Little tag right here says skate high reissue, um, size 10 and a half. I'll let you guys get the first look at them. Bam! Got our little. Read this off camera. Okay. Ooh, these are fresh. Nice. Ooh, plush. 
no, they're actually like really plush. Uh, these are the Vans Skate High Digi Alohas. Uh, as you can see, we got this Vans little uh, wave right here in white, and we have this uh, floral print on the main body part, and then we have black suede, uh, good quality, with white stitching, white laces, um, none of that like really fuzzy cushioning that you really that you normally see, but definitely uh, it's almost like the same material that you'd find in the inside, but they just plushed it up. Uh, so that's definitely nice. Um, it says van. This is my first pair of actual normal. Sorry about that, guys. My uh, battery died on my camera. I had to go re-switch uh, the batteries. Uh, first, like I said, the first pair of uh, actual normal bands, other than like a collab. That's what I normally get is the collabs. Well, skate high wise. Um, but it says bands, number world's number one skateboard shoe. Uh, that's pretty dope. It has a black suede with this white little tag right here. And then in black, it has a little skateboard and it says bands off the wall. Got a little bands tag right here that comes with pretty much all bands. Our white laces, right there, our normal insole, the leather uh, sock liner, um, usually uh, the back panel right here, the suede isn't always that good, um, I've yet to find like really good quality suede on a pair of bands, but you know, it's six and a half out of ten usually, um, at least this pair is about six and a half, maybe seven out of ten, uh, definitely could be better, but it's not the worst of worst, definitely seem better though, uh, I got a normal gum outsole with the white midsole and the black stripe, I've seen pairs without the black stripe and it's just still white right here, it just looks ugly to me, um, maybe not to other people, but to me it's really ugly. Uh, definitely looks nice, that white stitching, uh, the white laces definitely make it pop with this white leather, uh, part right here, and just that Aloha print is just, it's really nice. Um, so yeah, it's basically all there is for these. I believe, what's the retail on this? It's not the retail, but I think these are normally about 75, maybe like 80, around 85 after tax and shipping. Um, I'll leave the price that I paid after tax and shipping right here, um, just to let you guys know. Yeah, that's pretty much all there is for this video. Um, not for this video, for this unboxing portion of the video. So yeah, if you have a pizza comment, that was a steel deal or not for this. I already went through all that with you guys. So yeah, um, hold up, hold up. Hold up. When you're done, when you're done. Okay, you guys, you guys thought we are done. I love it. If you ever get a band, feel the bottom. It's almost like, no residue, but smooth. It's like, so smooth. I don't know how to explain it. But, uh, really quick, really quick. Thank you. 
Richie Lee's, uh, how subscribe to Richie Lee? He's, he's a man, dude, like, for real. Um, not this exact pair, but he, uh, they were talking about the, uh, what am I, the checkered authentic vans, or just the checkered vans in general, and they posted up a picture of somebody who was rocking them, and, uh, he had these, like, uh, jean type, he had basically these, except they're just more distressed, and with this ankle zip, and I was like, I was like, I need that, so I went on Google, and I, uh, found this, went to Elwood, first time going on Elwood, found this, and, uh, that's, you know, I found Elwood, was probably buying all this stuff, too, and I was like, yo, yeah, we got fire, I'm pretty sure I picked them up for, like, 25 bucks, we got a little Elwood thing right here, as you guys saw in those, uh, pianist joggers, those beige joggers, and we have a little Elwood right here, and we just got a plain nothing on the button right here, and you got a zipper for your crotch area. <laughs> uh, but yeah, these are so dope. Definitely be seeing them on foot uh, soon. And then while I was on there, I just, I was like, yo, this is 25 bucks, whatever. Let's, let's check out. They're, uh, that's pretty, that's pretty cheap for these, you know? So, if this is cheap, let's see what they have on sale. So, I go to what they have on sale, and I'm always like, bummer jackets, I just never, like, really know where they are, or, like, look too hard for them. And I was like, this was 10 bucks on sale, and I was like, this is pretty dope. I couldn't find medium, which is what I wanted to get. So, and I was only a small, because I was like, I'm going to grow up that, like, instantly. So, I think it was a large. Uh, this floral bomber jacket, it actually looks like it'll fit, like, pretty good. Maybe if I throw it in the wash, it'll, uh, trick us. But it's, like, all black with these, like, red roses and black roses and the flowers popping up. And you have this, uh, can't, what's this inside? Oh, we got this Elwood tag. Shout out to Elwood. I'm definitely leaving a link in the description. Then I think this is wool. Elwood again right here. But yeah, I think this is, like, wool. This is really nice. And, uh, yeah, dope. Yeah, but for freaking ten bucks, I was, like, even if it doesn't fit me, I can, like, try and make it work. And if it doesn't work, I can easily, like, resell this for, like, twenty bucks at least. But, no, it looks like it'll fit me. So that's a dope. Jeans, um, these joggers, uh, these joggers, 